the pharmacist that filled your prescription Hi. today. I have your new prescription for you. I'd just like to take a couple minutes of your time to talk to you about how to use the medication, what to expect from it, and answer any questions you may have. Can you have a seat for me? Sure. Okay, now let me just make sure we have the most up-to-date information in your profile before we get started. Are you still at 4475 Breachwood? Yes. Okay, and I have that you are currently on Augmentin, a multivitamin and benzoyl peroxide gel. Now, what changes to these medications have occurred since I last spoke to you? Uh, none. None, okay. And I don't have, oh, I have that you're allergic to sulfa. What new allergies have you developed since no. I spoke? Okay, great. So for you today, I have your Yaz prescription here. Now, what did the doctor tell you this medication was for? For my acne. Okay, yes, this is for your acne. Um, it's a hormone pill that's going to help try to control the hormones in your body to subside any of the acne that you've been experiencing. How did the doctor tell you to take this medication? Oh, he didn't say. Okay, so let me go ahead and show you. Um, here it is. It has 28 tablets in it, and it's marked for every week that you take it, and you'll take it every day of the, every day of the month for 28 days. Um, what you want to do is pick a time of the day that works best for you. So some people like to take it every morning at 8 a.m. or every evening with dinner. Um, you'll take one tablet by mouth daily. Um, you can take it with or without food. And it is important to make sure you take it every single day. Okay. Um, and what did the doctor tell you to expect from this medication? Mm, didn't say. Okay, there's a couple things I'd like to tell you about. Um, first off, you will see your acne improve. Um, it may take about a month or two um, of the pills before you start to see improvement. So do continue to take it before, before stopping it. Um, the other thing is you may experience some upset stomach, maybe a little bit of nausea or vomiting. So again, you can try to take it with some food to help that. It may go away in about three months after taking it. So. And then the other thing is it, unfortunately, there's one thing I have to warn you about. It may um, increase your chance of developing a blood clot. So some things you want to watch for in any extreme pain in your leg or if you have any problems breathing, make sure you contact me and your doctor immediately. And if you can't get a hold of us, go to the emergency room. Now I know that was a lot of information for you. Go ahead and tell me how you're going to take this medication. Well, it's a pack uh, good for four weeks. I'm going to take one tablet uh, once a day, about at the same time every day. Right. And again, don't forget to watch out for any of those symptoms you may experience in your leg or any problems breathing. Can't take it with or without food. Um, store it in a cool, dry place away from any moisture, any direct sunlight. And lastly, if you forget a dose, go ahead and take it as soon as you remember. Um, and you can, you can take two tablets in one day. Um, but if you miss more than two days, then go ahead and call me and we can work it out from there for you. Okay. And what other questions can I answer for you? I don't have any questions. No questions at all? Okay, well here's your prescription. You have two more refills after this one, so I will see you next month. If anything comes up, just give me a call. I'm here 24 hours a day. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.